We the gamers. Hey, I am Frozo, and this is Jurassic Shotgun. And we are the Conservative Gamers. And Happy New Year, everyone. It is finally 2016. And that means a lot of big news for us because we'll be doing a lot more in the future. We're going to start off our New Year video talking about the best conservative news of 2015. We'll both give our opinion on it. I'll let Jurassic Shotgun go first. For me, it's probably the leaps and bounds that Ted Cruz has taken in the polls. Ted Cruz has always been my favorite candidate. I've heard that he's really catched up to Trump and possibly has beaten Trump in Iowa, depending on which news story you're looking at. But he's definitely gotten way up there very quickly. For me, I'm a Donald Trump fan. I like how he's blunt. He's a little like me. If you ever see me in real life, I'm basically a more toned down version of Donald Trump. I like how Donald Trump said he was going to build a wall to stop illegal immigration because that is running rapid now. And our country is just not stable enough for something like that at all. Lose billions of dollars every year to people living off welfare. My dad works in the prison system and he sees that every day. Just guys come in who are just leeching off the welfare and off of people's taxes and all this kind of thing. Our next topic is our plans for 2016 because we started in November, but we haven't been able to keep our videos out like we wanted. We've had family issues come up and a lot of stuff. But in 2016, we will be keeping up more with gaming news going on and our opinions on that. Maybe add a few reviews and giveaways in there like we'll be mentioning later. We want 2016 to be big for us. We want a lot of growth and we want to give all the conservatives out there a voice because liberals have an agenda to wipe out conservatives at the moment. Like if you look in a YouTube comment where somebody posts a conservative comment, it gets flamed to death by liberals and we want to create a place where conservatives feel welcomed our next topic is the most anticipated game of 2016 and for me that is dark souls 3 miyazaki and from software have kind of burned through this new genre of games very quickly and dark souls 3 seems to be the climax and the finale of that whole genre of games not just this series it's looking to be as good as the original with elements from bloodborne as well there's two games I'm really looking forward to. The first one is Ukulele, which is original members that split from Rare, went on to make their own spiritual successor to Banjo-Kazooie, and I actually helped fund the Kickstarter for that. I'll be getting a good copy of Ukulele myself. I'm a real huge fan of the original N64 3D platformers. And the second game I'm looking forward to is Halo Wars 2. The original Halo Wars came out in March of 2009, and I'm really looking forward to a sequel to that. By the time Halo Wars 2 comes out in 2016, that'd be over seven years since the last one, and I really love that Halo RTS gameplay and finally we are finally getting it. Last time one came out I was like a teenager now I'm like in my 20s so that's like a big jump in time. And last but not least we will be announcing the game we talked about in our Christmas video that we will be giving away. The original Gears of War. We will be giving a digital download code to the game for free. We won't be doing that just yet and we won't be telling how we're going to do it but just be warned that we're giving the Gears of War copy away for free. So subscribe to us and like this video if you want to know more about that in the future. If you've never played the first Gears of War, this is your chance to do it. And that's about it. Any last words you want to say for the ending of 2015 and the beginning of 2016? I'm very much looking forward to the further videos we're going to do because I have big plans. And if you enjoyed the video, give us a like. If you want to watch more like this, subscribe. If you want a home for conservative gamers, also subscribe for that too. And until next time, our hat is off to you. And Happy New Year.